Hi all you Peppa Cura junkies out there, this is a furry animal and I was showing you my prototype and this piece here had to be altered and this piece here had to be altered. So that was the prototype. Moving on to this piece here where it's been altered, you can see there's a groove in there now. Whereas what I did is I made that flush, but lying at an angle, but flush. So it's lying at an angle there, but I've got this indentation here as well. I've also altered inside this is a kind of square cut. I actually cut it at 45, but to get it out, I had to do a square cut as well. But realise I just left it in as a straight cut because it makes it easier for the. So, some some people have glued the whole thing like that. I didn't like that idea because it's taken away from the feature. So it's just going to get closed just at the bottom. Just at the ropes. It's just going to get closed in it that wee bit there so it's just got a little indentation there and um, altered angles of this the if you look at the prototype it's it's deeper there it should be deeper here as well and the angle cuts as well for these side bits here are 30 degrees whereas on this one they're 35 degrees and it looked more square, boxed and sticky out more as opposed to, well it is kind of sticky out but not as severe. So I've got that piece there, I'm getting better with the glue because I'm not making them as much mess this time. I was using super glue to begin with and realised Super glue is going to cost a fortune, uh, so I had to practice with the hot glue gun, thinking hmm, it's going to take ages. But once I got there, it seems fine. Got the detailing in there as well. Now on the prototype, there should be another piece put in here because it, it doesn't look right. This piece seems to be lying at an angle going from left to right, it's going from left up the way to the right, um, so I don't know what's happened but when I, once I get to that stage I'll go back into the garage and get it sorted out, got a beautiful indentation there and there on that piece, of, you'll see it on the blue, see where I've, I've, I've curved it, you don't see any joins in it, it's just the way I've got it to fold on the, an external cut and pulled open and this was a 40, um, 45 degree cut but it wasn't put at 45 degrees it's just enough to do it so you can see the detail in there the uh, gluing's getting a little bit better this piece here was can, kind of funny because once this was glued in there was a gap between the, this, this piece here and this piece here so I had to push it in to glue it and it's, it's actually turned out alright. You can see it better on this where I had to push it in, it's caused this bit to bubble up a little bit but I've sorted that out and it's nearly the five minutes up for the video. I don't like to make my videos too long, I reckon five minutes is, is, is plenty. Um, I've still got um, other pieces to do. This is a piece, this piece is to be glued in. I just took a break from the garage. Sometimes it just drives you nuts. And that piece is to go in there. And it's going to have the, the indentation. This is actually a nice feature. Rather than have it flush. Where I, ha where I had it there flush. Let's glue it flush. Okay, thank you very much. And look forward to the next video.